Good evening. I'm going to try something a little different tonight. It's been a little while since I've done a music stream and I used to stream my piano practices. Um, but the problem with that is my laptop died. My piano and my comp and my desktop computer are both unmovable and they're on opposite sides of the room so I cannot stream piano from this computer unfortunately. So the live learn, the piano live learns are a thing of the past until I get another laptop, which is not in the budget right now because I have a functional desktop. So hopefully I can get that resolved at some point in the next few months. So I need to look elsewhere for music options. I have the kazoo stuff, which I know I haven't really done a lot with that uh, actually since before the summer hiatus. And that's because I want to get better with it before I do, before I uh, torture and bleed out your eardrums anymore with that. So um, back in college I played ukulele and I decided maybe I'll try and revive some of my ukulele skills. So the stream is a good avenue for that I think. Torture and bleed out. So um, what we're going to do tonight is I'm going to pick a few songs and try and learn the chords for that songs, maybe sing a bit. Probably not going to sing through whole songs just a verse and refrain to get a feel for the chords. I want to try and hit as many songs as possible. So I let's get right into the ukulele. Uh, so you, because it's ukulele, you get face cam tonight. And I'm going to show you my uh, my instruments, which I, I spent the last uh, 20 minutes trying to remember how to tune these things and we learn how to do that. So this is the actual ukulele I used in college. As you can see, there's uh, some dings and scratches on it. Though this one's well loved, shall we say, but still a perfectly functional instrument. Definitely still functional. But um, after I'd been using this ukulele for a couple of years, I went ahead and bought this one. I, uh, same manufacturer, same model line, the only difference is the color. This one I haven't really played at all. I haven't really even properly broken this one in even though I bought it like 10 years ago, more than 10 years ago. So I'll be focusing on using this ukulele tonight. But I'll do a few things on the, on the green one. A little bit of a warm-up exercise first. What am I doing wrong? I don't remember all my chords. Um, that's what some of these websites are for. So that chord should be there. All right, there we go. Let's see. As you can tell, I'm a little shaky on even the most basic of the chords. That's something I hope loosens up as we go through some of these songs tonight. We're going to start with a very Hawaiian sounding song that only uses the three basic ukulele chords, C, F, G, 7. Um, yes, it's a Disney song. So um, let me see if I can figure out these patterns first. So it's Thank you. 
I think if you're if you're a Disney fan, you know the song by now. I may start singing it in a little bit. It's a long song, so I'm not going to sing the whole thing. But I just want to get through these patterns first before I start trying to drop vocals on. Let's see if we can puzzle through this first verse. A long, long time ago, there was a volcano living all alone in the middle of the sea. He sat high above his bay, watching all the couples play and wishing, uh, wishing that he had someone to and from his lava came this song of hope that he sang out loud every day for years and years yeah i know it's not sounding good yet but like i said i'm rusty with the music and i was never good at singing but hopefully singing ukulele together they can sort of get a thing going, hopefully by the end of the evening. Let me take it from the top again. A long, long time ago, there was a volcano living all alone in the middle of the sea. He sat high above his bay, watching all the couples play, and wishing that he had someone too. And from his lava came this song of hope that he sang out loud every day for years and years. And there it goes. If you know it, sing along. I have a dream I hope will come true that you're here with me and, I'm, and I'm here with you. I wish that the earth, sea, and the sky up above would send me someone to love. A so yeah, of course, it's a cartoon about a volcano. And then the lady volcano who's, who appears to uh, save his song. And it goes on and on like this for like six minutes on just those three chords. And the animation is gorgeous and the music's gorgeous and I cannot do it justice. So um, let's skip to the last verse. Because on the last verse, let's skip to the happy ending. And I'll butcher this part just as much. And uh, since I'm one voice, obviously I can't do it justice. But... Oh, they were so happy to finally meet above the sea. All together now, their lava grew and grew. No longer are they alone with Aloha as their new home. And when you visit them, this is what they sing. All together now, I have a dream I hope will come true. That you'll, that you'll grow old with me, and I'll grow old with you. We thank the earth, sea, and the sky, thank us too. I love you. And I kind of tagged on one of my classic ukulele endings there. There's like a few stock ukulele endings. Um, we're going to lay that one to rest for tonight uh, because I want to try a few different songs here. Let me see if the song is on this list of tabs. Ah. How do the chords look on here?
Wow, that's a lot of chords. You have your C and your F and your G, uh, but we also have a whole bunch of other chords. <sighs> Some of which look like they're going to be finger crampers for sure. We want the G, C, E, A, U, G. All right. I need a B flat, C, B. Crap. I was never good at the B flat chord. I help. Mm, yeah. Let me see if I can find another tab for this one. Is this a is this a cleaner chord arrangement? I'm just trying to see what my fingers can actually contort to. That's gonna that's gonna be rough as well, I think. Anything in key of C. I'm I'm not gonna do this song. I'm wasting time already, probably. What's going on here? That's not what I thought it was. Oh, well, let's do a... Let me try typing in this song and see what kind of chords I can come up with for, for this one. Ah. Uh, it's not there. Let me try here. I didn't really have a plan coming into the stream for what exactly which songs I wanted to do. That's why nothing's pre-cued. Just that first song, which I felt was a good warm-up. D minor, C, F, G, M, A. Those are a bunch of chords I do not know. So it's a D minor. Oof. That's another chord I was never good at. Of course, big banner ad pops up right over the chord chart. What's this chord? Okay, that's an easy chord. Uh, okay, that's not going to be too terrible. Uh, which chord is this? That's not the chord.
flat? Where's my B flat? Ah, shoot. <laughs> It's a sad song anyway. Let's try something else. That one, I got to work on the chords. Oh, uh, shoot. Okay. If I can find one that has a. I probably shouldn't break into terribly difficult chords. Okay, that song's not coming up in that search. Let's try this search. Well, 20 minutes and I've only sampled one song so far. Okay. Let's see. Okay, yeah, no, definitely not those chords. My fingers do not twist that way. But this is a, all right, so there's a G. Not the cleanest, but I can do that chord, sort of. Oh, here's one that's actually, Looks like they tried to. Here's one with some chords that I. Let's try. So I need a D minor. Oops. What the hell are these chords? All right, and then uh, maybe all right, that chord sounds pretty nice. All right, so it looks like I know the G, I know the, but let's get solid on D minor and E7 real quick so, so that I can actually play this song. All right, E7 is pretty clean. I just got to memorize that chord for the song. Let's come back to D minor. All right, so D minor, not too terrible. Unfortunately, this is a site that doesn't have the tabs directly in front of me. So then it does that. And then, of course, there's the G, which is. And there's an F, but F is basic. Oh, wait. And then there's an A, but I think A is also pretty basic. I think that's basic A. 
Let me just look it up real quick. Yep, all right. So the A won't be an issue. So it goes to you. So then there's an E minor as well. Yeah, we're going to skip that part. We're going to we're going to play the last verse. Because the first the first two verses are what the eight candles are about and then the last verse is the bringing it all together. Um, so let me just puzzle through the chords real quick first. I forgot my G. How did I forget my base of G? I was just looking at it. I can't get the G too cleaning, too clean. goes Enough of a thing going that I'm okay trying to sing this one. This is going to be the final verse of uh, Light One Candle. We're not going to spend too much time on it. But this is a very good Peter, Paul, and Mary song that um, has become associated with Hanukkah uh, because of the eight candles. and actually specifically references the Maccabees. So uh, I'm sorry if my uke's not perfectly in camera. Maybe if I uh, tilt down, but then you'll cut off a little bit of my face. All right. What is the memory that's valued so highly that we keep alive in the flame? Flame. What's the commitment for those who have died? We cry out they have not died in vain. I like that chord right there. We have come this far, always believing that justice will somehow prevail. Oh, still can't get that G right. This is, this is the burden. This is the promise. And this is why we will not we will not fail. I like that E7 chord. Huh. Don't let the light go out. It's lasted for so many years. Don't let the light go out, let it 
shine through our love and our tears. Don't let the light go out. It's it's lasted for so many years. Don't let the light go out. Let it shine through our love and our tears. And that goes into a little bit of a riff and uh, stuff happens. And I'm not terribly upset with that one. It's very rough. I need a lot of work. That's a song we will revisit. But you know what song? But you know what song has only four chords? We're going back into sad song territory. If it's there. Uh, Let's see, can I find, this one is labeled as easy. I don't believe easy. But it is a four chord song. Now it's a very long song. This is a very long song, so we're, we're only going to sing a bit of it, but there's only four chords. So, second fret, on the C, third fret. Is that right? That doesn't sound right to me. That does say second fret. That chord is definitely not sounding correctly. But I'm copying it the way it is on the chart. Hmm. Well, we're not going to sad. All right. Yeah, I was totally unprepared for this. Here I was thinking I was going to come back after not having picked up my ukulele in a few years and magically be able to remember all the songs and chords I used to know. Clearly, that's not happening here. We'll need to do a few more ukulele streams where I sound like this. We got a good start though. Let me pick. Let me pick something a song that will actually. Here's a song that might sound good on ukulele, depending on the chords, and I'll work on some of these chords. I'll work on some of these chords off stream as well, so that next time I come back, we'll have a solid start on at least these songs. That's a lot of chords, but a lot of them are basic. Unfortunately, it doesn't have the. Oh, this is the one that this is the one that scrolls the tablature. All right, let's review these chords real quick. A minor. C, C7, and then F, but it wants a different version. No, no, that's not F, that, sorry. No, that's an E. My finger doesn't twist that way. Does it? Not cleanly, but passable.
I was never good at these uh, finger twisting chords even back then, so I'm not too I'm not too upset about this because this is comparable to how my fingers twisted back then when I played in college. And then uh, this, the chords aren't going to be too clean for this one, but I think it's doable. I also can't sing it because the lyrics are in Spanish. This is not the version with the English lyrics. So. Um, let's skip to the refrain. I'm attempting the chords from Dos Origitas from Encanto. When I find the English lyrics, we're actually going to try and sing this one. If I think I'm going to actually call a stream early tonight because I'm getting tired and this is frustrating and I was totally unprepared. I want to do some chord work off stream so that I can give you a little bit of a better stream next time I attempt this. Yeah, without the English version of the lyrics, my brain's having a hard time just placing where these chords are in the song. So let me pick another song to close with instead. Let's see if this site has this song. I can't imagine this one would be particularly difficult. Three chords. None of them are chords I know, but But wait a minute, if I go up a step, C, G, and A flat becomes B. Well, down a step, so C, G. No, uh, this one's not going to work either. Crud. We're just going to call it. Um, I'll mark today as kind of a little bit of a failure, but we got a nice little start with the first song at least. Um, who are we rating? Neo Kellalums. They're, yeah, they're, they're the obvious rating for tonight. They're an elderly Singaporean couple who are the reason I picked up my ukuleles after 10 years in the first place. So, because I was listening to their uh, ukulele show one night a couple months ago, and I realized, hey, can't do piano on stream right now. Let's try some ukulele instead. And it took me forever to get to the point where I wanted to try on stream. So here we are, and it's all thanks to them, the ne Neo Kellalims. And let's go, let's go say hi to them. 
And today's stream is, uh, was made possible because of their inspiration a couple months ago that I didn't have a chance to act on until just now. Obviously, it's still a work in progress, but let's go say hi. The raid has been initiated. Done. Have a good night. Possible because the raid has been initiated. Have a good night. You may have no. missed it. Missed it. I missed a lot. Okay. Sorry. Okay, no, no worries. Don't be sorry. Uncle Evie, how was your stream? How was your stream, Evie? Thank you so much. Should we call you Uncle or Evie? Mm -hmm. uh, as for one of the one change the world, we keep a lot of the most important ones. Don't get so excited. We've got a, a, a lot of tech goes in the world. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, Netherlands! Don't worry. Okay, I understand. Um, uh, English is not your first language, so I get you. I totally get you. Thank you for saying that. Thank, Thank you, Water. Thank you, Water. We have a lot of listeners from the Netherlands, um, uh, including one of our one of our mods, uh, Twinklebouter. So please do come back again. We change up our time a lot. I attempted to practice with the lady tonight, but terribly out of practice. Just as long as yeah, you keep, keep doing it. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It'll come back. You know, you keep playing. If you follow people on YouTube, you sing the songs, it'll definitely come back. She learned on YouTube, and she became such a good player, she doesn't have to look. Within two weeks, she didn't have to look down at the ukulele, you know? So thank you uh, for giving a shout-out to Twinklebouter. 